Hey, what's up everybody? Adam with DIY Agency. And in this video, we're gonna cover why Adstera is, in my opinion, the best Google AdSense alternative available. So if you're not familiar with Adstera, it's basically a CPA network. Uh, it allows publishers and advertisers to meet all in one network and basically allows you to either place ads across a network of, uh, of affiliate websites and or if you're an affiliate like me, uh, it allows you to build websites and basically just put ads on your website and Adstera does the job of figuring out what would be a relevant ad on your website. So I create lots of different uh, websites um, very passively and then Adstera does the work once I put some code onto their website or onto my website and basically it just shows banner ads that every time it gets a, 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 a click um, or even a view, I'm making money. So let's jump in be behind the scenes and show you how this works. So I primarily use banner ads, but I do want to share with you exactly what the opportunities are as far as different uh, different ad solutions. First of all, there's the pop under ad, um, which is real simple. If you're uh, you know on your website, somebody uh, lands on it. Basically, what it does is puts a another uh, ad, a, a full page ad underneath that allows you to uh, you know or allows them to kind of promote their their product um, or service offering, and uh, it's just you know based on visitors. Um, there's a simple social bar, which uh, you saw the pop-up, um, real simple. Um, there's native advertising. Uh, I'm sure you've seen these types of uh, ads available. Um, there is video ads that uh, are also a good option um, if you have a website, kind of like what I'm about to share with you. And then, of course, there's the banner ads, which are going to be simple ads uh, up top, um, on the sidebar, uh, stuff like that. So let's take you behind the scenes to one of my websites and uh, show you what it looks like. Actually, I'm going to share two different websites. Uh, so this is modeltrainexpress.com. And basically what it is, it's a simple ClickBank-based site um, where uh, I'm promoting a product, Model Trains for Beginners. Um, which is a ClickBank, uh, there's a couple different ClickBank products. But what I do want to show you is this World of Tanks ad that's right here. This is the Adstera ad. Um, again, as you can tell, I've got other, other stuff going on here, but the primary uh, ad from Adstera is, uh, is this. And I do, again, of course, make money from these uh, ClickBank ads that are on the side and the links in here. Another example would be uh, uh, golf tips and videos. Um, uh, again, I'm promoting different types of products all over the place, but I do want to show you the World of the Tanks ad, um, and I'll just take you to the homepage just so you know that I'm doing the same thing. Um, no matter where it is, again, um, you know, no matter what the, uh, the, the, the situation is, uh, I'm running basically one ad. So I quickly want to show you behind the scenes, um, you know, just show you, you know, the revenues that I'm making. I'm currently owed, uh, you know, $115. Um, I've made about $500 uh, with them so far. Um, I do have a number of different websites. Uh, as you can tell, there's some, some websites get a lot of clicks, some don't get a lot of clicks. So um, it's not just ne necessarily about clicks, it's about impressions as well. Um, so Model Train Express uh, right there had seven clicks, made $65, um, but the CPM is $6. That's a really high and really nice CPM. Um, very low CTR, click-through ratio, but the, uh, the cost per thousand um, of, of visitors is very significant, so I'm getting a good, uh, good return on that. And again, um, you know, not a lot of clicks here on golf tips and videos, but um, a, a decent CPM, cost per thousand, um, and on, you know, basically it's my highest revenue site. Um, so let's talk about how things work as far as uh, the links and the websites. So if I wanted to put a, uh, an ad on a site, basically really, real simply what I would do is just add a new website. Um, I'd put the address in here. Um, I select a category, social adult uh, movies, ad adult social movies, adult um, Earl shorteners, MP3s, um, basically all kinds of different things. I usually just use social um, or, uh, or other. And basically, um, you know, it, it gives you different available ad units. So you can select the one that you want to create, uh, remove campaigns with erotic ads, ads with sounds, whatever you're looking for. And then once you do that, you press add, it will take you into a, uh, a situation where basically that, um, that particular, uh, you know, 
th- that will be pending. And then within usually about a, a minute or two, they're actually going to give you approval or disapproval. Um, I found that the approval is very, very fast, very, very easy. Um, and then really what we're doing is we're just adding, again, the code. So once you have one, you go ahead and create another. Um, you know, again, same thing, um, downloads or whatever category you're looking for. Um, and again, it'll, it'll show you the ad unit. You can change the placement name. Um, it'll show you a status. Um, it'll give you stats. Um, and getting code is real simple. So you just literally copy that and you just you know, put that into your website or use a widget. Uh, I'm not gonna go into detail about how to place ads on your website. If you're watching this, you probably already understand that. Um, if you need assistance, just shoot a, a note down below and uh, I, I can make a quick video on that and share that with you in the comments. But I just wanted to share this with you quickly. All right, so heading back to the Adsterra website, uh, if you are an advertiser, it'll give you kind of a, a lot of reasons why to use that, why to use it, um, pricing models, all that stuff. Um, publishers, this is kind of the the, uh, the benefits of you know getting passive income, which I certainly love, as you know, um, by just simply putting ads on my websites and not having to do anything but collect a check. Um, they do give you a couple different options as far as payments. Let's jump into that. So the payment options are real simple. You can use PayPal, uh, WebMoney, Paxom, Wire Transfer. They do offer Bitcoin and Tether, um, and there are different you know currencies. There's different minimum payouts, and of course there's different fees associated. Um, I personally use Bitcoin, um, and it's a minimum payout, and the network fee is included. Uh, and just so you know, um, you know the fee amount depends on the crypto exchange um, rate at the time. So basically, it's it's what I think is the easiest and best. Um, I do like the opportunity down the road for Bitcoin, even though it's getting annihilated right now. So I uh, I want to make sure that I get a uh, you know get my payouts in Bitcoin, and it's just a set it and forget it, and you know hopefully down the road in 10, 15 years it'll be uh, worth a hell of a lot of money. Um, they do have a referral program as well, which I'm going to actually put a link in. Um, it's five percent of uh, of the referrals lifetime revenue, so it's a good opportunity there. Um, I will have a link um, to my uh, referral down below, um, but real simple. Payments are made um, usually just about once a month. Um, they, they are very clear about their payment dates. Um, there are some FAQs on their website as well, and there are all kinds of different resources on how to profit from traffic, you know, if, uh, how to advertise offers, and then you know, specifically if you're looking for a CPA network, this is a great opportunity. So um, I'm gonna put the link in below. I'd uh, love to have you guys as my affiliate. If you do sign up with me, um, I'll be your resource. If you do have any questions or, or, or you know concerns, as as well as as Tara's team, um, I'm always there to help out my uh, my personal affiliates. So uh, sign up with me, and I'll be there to help you out and guide you, and maybe teach you a few things on how to make some extra money. Um, something that I, I think is really really critical um, that you do pay attention to is um, I do recommend building um, other stuff in. Don't just make it an ad based website. Um, it's good to have one, but it's not great to have 30 ads on one thing because um, what ha- what'll happen is you'll see the same ad. Uh, multiple times for the same thing if you have a couple different blocks for example so I do recommend that you kind of integrate it with any uh, any kind of other affiliate products or, uh, or, or solutions so hopefully this video brought you some value um, please like it and uh, subscribe below and if you do have any questions again drop them in the comments and I look forward to uh, to bringing more content that uh, hopefully you'll like and enjoy in the future